Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy Tab A 8 inches and today I will show you how to hard reset the device through recovery mode. Now for this process you will need a computer, it doesn't really matter what kind of computer it is, uh, we just need to plug it into it and that's about it. And from there also well, take that cable that is plugged into your computer, connect it to your tablet. There we go. And as you can see it's charging now. And from here, I'm gonna lock the device. Um, no, I don't actually have any kind of screen protection, uh, but normally if you do, this will also allow you to remove it. And I'm gonna show you how you would go about it, because normally with a screen lock, you do need to turn off the device and provide the you know, pattern, pin, password, whatever it is to actually turn off the device. So to bypass this, what you wanna do is hold volume down and power key together till the screen turns off. From there, you're gonna switch to holding a volume up and power key until you see the Samsung logo on the screen, at which point you will let go of only the power key and keep holding a volume up. So now let's light up the screen, volume down, power key. It will capture a screenshot, don't worry about that one. Keep holding. Now we got turned off, I believe. There's the Sam. Oh, let's do it again. There we go. So once you see the Samsung logo, let go. As you can see, it turned off because I held it for a little bit too long. So just keep holding it till you see it again and then let go. So you will let go of only the power key while continuously holding volume up. And there we go. We should now be in the recovery mode. And from here, using volume keys, you want to scroll down in order to select wipe data, factory reset, and then confirm it with power key. And once more, select factory data reset. This will begin formatting data, data wipe complete. And from there, reboot system now will be selected by default. So press power key once more to simply reboot your device. And also on that, this point, you can unplug the cable. It's not needed. Now, once you reboot the device, it will continue to perform a reset of the device in the background. So it will take it significantly longer, specifically on this device, uh, for it to boot back up. Um, but don't worry, it's not stuck or anything. It's just basically working on it in the background. It's not showing anything uh, that will indicate that it is. It will look like it's basically stuck. Um, but once it's finished, we will be then presented with the Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is actually visible. And as you can see, now the process is finished, and you can set up your device as however you like. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.